Marianne, if you're someone who hasn't heard of Tatiana McFadden, well, you probably will, because not only is she a three-time gold medalist, but she is the first person ever to win four of the marathon majors, London, Boston, Chicago, and New York City. And now the wheelchair racer has her sights set on skiing in next year's Winter Games. Walk by Tatiana McFadden on the street, and you may not know you're walking by a 10-time Paralympic medalist and the only person ever to win four of the marathon majors. Born in Russia, McFadden lived in an orphanage the first six years of her life. Everywhere she went, she walked on her hands. My legs were atrophied behind my back, and so that's the only way I could get around. Born with spina bifida, the 24-year-old defied the odds at birth. I was laying in the hospital with my back open for 21 days, um, had, had no medical procedures, no medical attention. She was operated on and then at six years old she was adopted and moved to the States. The first time I got involved with sports was just to get healthy, was just to gain independence, strength, to, to be able to do daily life activities. She fell in love with wheelchair racing, nicknamed Beast in the training room. How's that speed looking, Beast? 49 weeks out of the year, up to 14 hours a week, McFadden practices. That's just what it takes. I mean, to be successful at, at the highest level, that's the type of volume that you have to, to build. But now McFadden prepares for her newest uphill climb, Nordic skiing in the Sochi Winter Games. In terms of um, I'm just talking about fitness and power. I would put Tatiana up against any other female in the world. McFadden's just several weeks into training. Like five minutes. On this day, yeah. 52 minutes of erging. For cross country skiing, it takes strength and endurance, which I have. It's just technique is what I'm still learning. But snow and hills don't seem like too big a challenge for a beast. McFadden and her coach expect her to qualify for next year's Olympic Games, but she will be training with a special ski coach. This would be her first time at the Winter Games. I'm Elise Meneker for WAND News.